everybody! Welcome back to another exciting episode of Kitty Cat Gaming. Today I have a new mobile game to share with you guys. This one's called Plant Nanny. And uh, it's the mobile game where you take care of plants and in the process it reminds you to drink more water. It's supposed to be like a great game to remind you to stay hydrated. If you turn on notifications on your phone, it sends you messages and tells you when you should be drinking water. Um, so I just opened it for the first time and it says, why plant nanny? People need water. Water occupies 70% of our body weight. Plant nanny lets you plant cute plants on your iPhone. You can water your plants anywhere, anytime. Tell us your activity status and weight and we'll tell you how much water you need per day. Every time you drink a cup of water, your plant will also absorb the water. Then it will keep up growing up. Uh, we will remind you how many cups of water you need today. Let's begin. Press to start. Uh, okay, so we do ounces. Uh, water makes up approximately 70% of your body weight. Uh, your weight influences the amount of water you need to require each day. Uh, so I'm going to put to pounds. Okay, and I'm 140. The extent of your daily exercise can influence significantly the amount of water you should drink. The more active you are, the more water you need. How? What is your activity level? Um, I would say I'm pretty regular. I go for like an hour walk each day, so it's not so bad. Um, and then we have to choose your plant. Uh, we can get Devil's Ivy. Dandelion. A cactus. Chick Fern. Oh my god. I come from the tropics. My slim body allows me to swing freely, which helps me dodge my natural enemies. My specialty is to tweet like a bird. Kids love to play with me. Benjamin. Not even like a plant name, it's just Benjamin. I come from Central America. I'm very clever and mature. I enjoy quiet and peaceful surroundings. I'm your best companion when meditating or reading. He's cute. Difficulty level two. Needs 20 seeds. Produces two seeds a day? Mushrimp? Mushrimp? I come from the deep blue sea. I can live in humid and rainy environments, and I love dancing in the wind. I am also very timid and easily frightened. I'm commonly used to heal the brokenhearted. Aww. More plants. More interesting and cute plants are coming soon. Follow us for our latest news on the Facebook page. Um, so we're back at the beginning, and I missed reading these ones. We have the Devil's Ivy, which says, I come from the South Pacific and love damp areas. I can even survive in shaded or covered areas. Lots of people use me to decorate their homes. And he was only difficulty level one. Uh, I come, uh, Dandelion says, I come from Eurasia. I'm very tough and vi vivacious. My leaves look like a set of teeth. My English name derives from... Dent de lion in French, which means lion's tooth. Kids love me because I'm very cute. And cactus. Just very cactusy. All right, so let's go through Devil's Ivy and plant it. And I'm going to name him. Oh, I didn't get to name him. I want to name him Thomas. Open the cup container. Create new cup. Oh, so this is like what we're drinking. Okay, so I have a bottle of water here right now, and it is 33.8 fluid ounces. You, it doesn't go that big? Create. A long press to drink. Excellent. You still need to drink four more cups of water today. Keep going, and then you will have a healthy body. Uh, so that's great. So you can pick how much water is in whatever cup you're drinking. And when you drink the water, it feeds your plant that water as well. Um, so it's incentivizing you to drink more water every day, um, which is great because like it can drastically change your mood if you're dehydrated. Um, if you're dehydrated, you can have headaches more likely, body aches. Like if you work out and you don't drink a lot of water afterwards, you'll get sore all over. But if you drink a ton of water, that soreness will go away. Like it's stuff like that. Um, you really need water. I can't stress it enough, guys. Like I didn't drink water until I moved to California because in Florida, it's so humid. You can kind of just drink anything. You don't need to drink water. It's weird. 
But now that I live in California, I've been here for 10 years. I started drinking water and I can't imagine life without it. Like, it's crazy to think there was a time where I was just like, water, gross. I'd rather have like an iced tea or something. So, yeah. Um, it says we still need to drink four cups today. So you can just kind of lie though, right? And just say you drink all your water in one sitting. Warning, drinking too much water at once can be dangerous. Slow down and drink later. Okay, so that's what it does. When you poke it, it just makes a sound. So it says we're at 41% of our water for the day. Took a picture of our plant. It's cute, you can share it on social media, show your friends. Water of life, applying one drop of water of life to your plant will help it grow faster for a period. Let's use it. Wow. Uh, what else we got? Flower shop from outer space. Download Walker to unlock the scene now. I guess it's just like a background for your plant. You can make it look like your plant's in space and you have to download another game to get it. Ooh, that vines teapot, a uh, flower pot. Discover five planets and Walker to unlock this. Walker must be their new game. Like they must be promoting that hardcore. Does this flower pot uh, enmeshed with vines resembles a pair of warm hands protecting the quiet growth of plants. There's also a galaxy one, star onion, download. Yeah, it's all, what happens if we hit validate? What happens? Nope, I don't want to. Uh, yeah, okay, so new families. We can download new plants. There's bamboo, clover, belchnum, rose, cyclamen, carnations, cabbage, radish berry, tulips, morning ghost, and a snow bush. What is a morning ghost? Oh, it's so cute. I come from another world, excluding a tranquil aroma. Exuding a tranquil aroma. I have a high tolerance for cold and like to hide in dark corners quietly blooming. Enjoy the serenity brought by the moonlight. Oh my god, it's so cute. So I just downloaded him. And you can also get more water of life to grow your plants. There's seeds, which you can use uh, to buy other plants. And then these are all the different pots. Oh my god, the magic hat is so cute. Ah, uh, rabbits often jump out of the magic hat. That's so cute. What else do they got? The chocolate one's cute. Chinese drum is cute. Doggy flower pot. Oh my god, the jack-o'-lantern! Jack-o'-lantern, the most important item that you cannot miss on Halloween. Yes. Or the witch's brew. Ah, oh, it's so cute! Wow. I love all of these. And then the background, you can get Mount Fuji, Lantern Festival. Yeah. Wow. So where do we put our new friend then? Where is he? When your plant grows up, you can move it here and plant a new one. Didn't we just buy a plant though? Where'd it go? Ah, ah. Uh, I guess it's somewhere in here. Scenes for your plant. Body information, volume units, show clock, sound effects. Oh, Charlie clock. Sync to iCloud, garden animation, drinking reminders. So there you can like set um you can you can set this up on your computer at work and you can see the time and watch your plant. Uh be reminded of, you know, how much water you're drinking for the day. I don't know. This is just like a great little tool. I, I think this would be a great game to get. Not even game, but like, you know what I mean. Just something to help you drink more water, honestly. It's fun. It's gamifying life, which, you know, I think is awesome. Everybody could use a little bit more help with their daily life, right? And to be able to, like, just have something that makes it fun. I think that's a great tool. I, I, I think that's great. Okay, I'm going to level them up and see what happens. Well, I guess you still have to wait, huh? What happens if I drink more water? You still need to drink two more cups of water today. Oh, well, it has no way of knowing, right? 
Level up. Congratulations. You have reached level two. Great job. <laughs> look at my babe. Uh Oh, wow. Look, he changed. Okay, so yeah, if you want to see what he looks like full grown, you just got to keep growing him and drinking water. Um, but let me know down below what you guys think about this game. I think this is a great idea, a great concept. What would you think uh, other games like this could be that they could use and make to gamify your life and make it easier? Like if there was like a game like this, it would help you with homework. Or a game like this, it would help you be more mindful um, and breathe better. Like that game Self Care we played the other day. Like... There's all kinds of games out there. You just need to find one that suits you. And if there is one, there isn't one that you want, you should make it. Uh, I fully believe that you can do anything you put your mind to. Um, and this game is a great tool that is super useful and uh, it could help a lot of people. So I'm really interested where this direction of self-help games are going. Like, this is amazing. Uh, so yeah, if there's another self-help game out there that you guys like and you want me to check out, please be sure to leave me a comment and tell me all about it. And be sure to that subscribe button so you guys don't miss my next video. And I'll see you guys all next time. Bye, everybody!